I was just riding my bike down the street, and there's a group of uh, people like on the corner, and um, like I know the area was pretty bad, and I knew what gang they were in, cause like I just I just know the areas, and one of the like I, I don't I would probably say maybe they're like teenagers. That was also a teenager at the time. I was maybe like 15, maybe somewhere around there. And they were all standing in the corner and they were yelling at me. They're like, oh, that's my bike. And they started running at me fast as fuck. Like, bro, they were running. Like, I thought they were like, you saying, oh, they were fast as fuck. Like, they, don't, they, were, they were like, they didn't catch up, but like, because I was on a bike. But like, damn, they were fucking fast, bro. But yeah, I, I mean, I easily got away. They're not taking my bike. They got me fucked up. And then... Oh, she got shit on. And then a second time... Where I almost got... No, third time where I almost got robbed. Um, this one was the one where I was like, scared the most. I was... Yes, punch. <laughs> nah, you just doesn't... Bro, what? What the fuck did I just read? Anyways, I was, so okay, basically, we have like a group of friends who all ride bikes, right? Yeah, but they had like people on BMX bikes, fixies, like, it was like a group of friends that ride, ride bikes together. Um, oh, why'd she blink that way? I got a no reg on the fucking blink prediction? Bullshit. I'm fucking dead. What the fuck? Anyways. Where, where was I at? Oh, okay. So basically, we had like a group of friends that had a group of friends that had a group of friends that all ride bikes. And I, like one of their bikes got stolen. Like they had a very expensive VMX bike. And obviously, he wants it back. And apparently, they knew who stole it. So they set up that guy to. I don't know how they set it up. Like, I don't know how, how they convinced the guy that stole the bike to join them. Like, I don't know if they were like friends, friends of friends that were like, oh, yeah, let's go over here. I don't know the story. I just knew that they were setting him up and we were gonna go to the skate park. Try to come point, try to come point, I need help on point. Big one, big one on point. Damn, get real. Are they at least using that now? Come on, come on. God. So yeah, like they were setting him up. Like we were like riding like 25 deep, bro. Like. 25 deep in the middle of the street, like not giving a fuck. Cars, cars honking at us, like no, nope, like none of us cared. Like we're all like annoying ass teenagers with bikes, not giving a fuck. And but yeah, we all went to the skate park, and then the guy, like, walked up to the dude that had the bike stolen, and he's like, "Yo, that's my bike." And like they were like talking, he's like, "All right." And he hops off the bike and gives it to him. Like this guy's literally surrounded. Like there's no way he's gonna be like, "Nah, like, give me this bike or try to get away." Like that's not happening. So like the guy gave up his bike. The... No deflect. He gave up the bike and then like he walked away. I'm assuming he's just like walking home or whatever. How would you? Hold. Wait, in my windows. Oh, wait, I have no cooldowns. I'm throwing. So yeah. That, that so the guy that had the bike stolen hopped out the bike give it give it to him and then like he i guess he walked home i don't know what the fuck he did like he just they left from the group and like all of us were still at the skate park just chilling and then me and my friends uh wow if i did that my old wouldn't fucking kill anybody me and my friends were just chilling at the skate park and then we just went home and then later on so like this is the, this is the part where this this is the part where i started to get scared this was so this was during high school and the kid that had the bike stolen, like the guy that no, the guy that stole the bike originally, he goes to my high school, and I didn't know that. And the, and then the worst part is, this guy's literally in a fucking gang in our school. And the gangs in my school, are like, like this is not like some like regular teenager shit. Like, like these people are like, like these people have guns and shit. Like I'm not even joking. But these people actually have fucking guns. And like I know I know like. Like the gangs in my squad are really serious. Like it's not like some like cringe people in a group that are like trying to act all cool. Like like these people are like that serious. Yeah, we have like my gang, my, my school is full of gangs. Like shit, ghetto as fuck. This is a really ghetto school. Um, 
Wait, bro, you had like metal detectors and everything. Anyways, like this, every time, like I would like go from class to class. Like this guy would side eye me. Like, he'd always look at me, and I was like scared as fuck. Like I know, I know, like the group that he's in is like that serious, and um, he would always look at me and shit. Like in, I'm dead. He'd always look at me. No, nobody brought guns into school. But there was a rumor where somebody did brought a gun once, and like you heard gunshots like literally right after school before. Which is kind of crazy. Hello. But yeah, that, that, I mean that was like the most, if anything. And so yeah, like this is every, every time like we go from class to class, and like I see him, he would look at me like mad as fuck. And I was like, like that's when I was like genuinely scared, cause I was like, like bro, if I get like jumped by this dude or like by this fucking gang, like, like there's, there's literally nothing I could really do about it. There's literally nothing. But like some of the people that are, some of the people that are in his gang is like, I'm actually cool with them. I'm same gang actually. That's Ash. No coach. Like, there's like a lot of people in his gang that I'm actually really cool with and I went to school with them for a really long time. Um, but I didn't know everybody in his crew. what I do? Bro, you missed out. I was talking about that all the time. Big love, big love. But anyways. So then one day, this is like, I don't know if this was on a school day or an off day or whatever. But me and my friend, just me and my other friend, it's like one person, we went to a skate park on our bikes. Like we're just like chilling and we were going home afterwards and we were passing by my school and I recognize the guy who got his bike stolen on the corner by my school. Like he's like him and his friend. Like his friend was on a bike and his uh his other friend was just standing in the corner. Like it was just like it's chilling there. Like that's like where they usually hang out at. But yeah, I, I saw that guy there and I told my friend, I'm like, yo, that's the guy that like that we kinda had set up to get his bike back. And like I was telling him like yo we got a fucking dip like like cause like my friend doesn't know the guy that we set up he doesn't know who he is he doesn't know like if he's in a gang or anything like he doesn't know anything about him but like I do cause like we didn't go to the same school I don't know why did I think there's somebody there oh I got so scared I'm just gonna push me. okay that's bullshit so I told my friend like oh we got a dip like like there's no way we can stay here and like they they spotted us. And I guess that guy saw me, and he sent his friend who was on a bike to like go go towards us. And I told my friend we got a dip. No deep like What? What? So I start running away, and the guy on the bike started following me, and I went through the alley, and I'm like I'm like pedaling fast as fuck. On a low. Um, I'm pedaling fast as fuck because I'm actually scared. And I hope they can deal with this shit. Oh, not the brick ulting. Oh, my team got this right. Yes. So I thought apparently fast as fuck. This guy, this guy's like on a cheap ass mountain bike, following me in the alley. And I had pepper spray on me, so I was just spraying backwards. I was just spraying backwards, and I just fucking dipped. I I was like crossing the street with my bike fast as fuck. Yo, let's talk with the prime thing about. I was crossing the street fast as fuck on my bike. Soggy I'm like, just I'm described. like, I'm like hitting the fucking bunny hops. I'm hitting the bunny hops over the curb, and I'm like running away. Like I'm scared as fuck. Like I'm actually, like I'm genuinely scared because like I know like, like they would actually take my shit. Like I had, a, I had a decently expensive bike, so I also didn't want to get that stolen. And like anything else on me stolen, I, I would assume I had a phone on me, and like I said, a phone and a bike. I don't know what else. Maybe like some cash. But yeah, anyways, I dipped. Anyways, I dipped. Um, he couldn't catch up to me. I was hitting the, I was hitting the bunny hops. And then I called my friend, like, he was not answering. And I was, like, actually worried about him. I'm like, oh, fuck. Like, there's no way he got caught by, like, somebody else. But, like, he, he, he calls me later. And then uh, he split up. And then I just told him, like, all what happened. And, like, he was okay. He, like, he made it out. I made it out. And the crazy part is... So later on, that guy, the guy, the guy I was talking about who got his bike stolen, no, well, the one that stole the bike originally, right? That guy, right now, as of right now, he's in prison for murder right now. And like, he killed somebody at like 17. Yeah, that guy, that guy's literally in prison right now for murder. Um, he killed, he killed, he killed a person for, 
So like somebody in his gang died. Somebody in his gang died. Big one, big one, big one. Nice. I'm gonna get fucking dicked down. Jeez. Yo, venture one. Um, somebody in his gang died, and then somebody dissed that dude on social media about like the dead guy, and like that pisses off his gang, and that guy is now like in prison for murder. And also the guy that I told you that was on the mountain bike. The one that was following me, he's also in, he's also in uh, prison for murder, and I think he was also 17 at that time. Like that's why that's why I was scared. Like I know like like these people are like they are, like I know that they do shit like that. Like, that's the reason why I'm scared. Like there's no way I'm gonna be defending myself. And like even if I did, like let's say I one v one one of them and I like I somehow won. But like, bro, they're gonna get their fucking gang on me. <laughs> like, I'm not gonna win. And like, almost like everybody in his gang right now is pretty much... They're pretty much in prison for murder. Or they got shot and killed. Like, a, bun a bunch of them have been shot at. Um, a bunch of them have been shot and killed. And a bunch of them are in prison for murder. They all got caught up. And like, they're doing this shit like when they're teenagers. It's fucking wild. No, I'm not gonna. I'm not. I mean, I'm not gonna say where, but I mean, I don't. I definitely don't live in a like good neighborhood. I live in a pretty ghetto neighborhood. There's a lot of gangs. Yeah, that had some was so clean. I'm not from Oblock now. I would probably say Oblock is definitely worse. I will achieve my vision. Like I would say my area is bad, but not like Oblock type of bad. I think Oblock is fucking crazy. Oh, Hanzo one. What am I stuck on, man? They nano Hanzo, of course. No sleep. You fucking bitch. Um. Yeah, like there's like a lot of, like in, like in my in my high school like there was a lot of people that were in gangs and there was like fights almost every day. It was really bad. I do content creation full time right now. Oh shit, I saw that coming. Bro, let me play the game! Are oh, you taking me out? Oh, okay. Ooh, the bounce off the thing. That is one. Me. Yeah, like you definitely want to be like careful if you're like outside and shit. You kind of have to. You definitely want to keep like an eye behind your back at all times. Um, you never know if you're gonna have people sneaking up on you, trying to like steal your shit. Like you can't you can't be like walking around with uh with headphones earphones on and what's it called you can't be like walking with like headphones earphones on and not like giving a single fuck about anything like you need to you need to be aware of your surroundings it's definitely important. Clearing. 
No, I didn't get a fucking. Okay. Ana's right spawn. I want their Ana. Let's sleep, let's sleep. I believe in you. No nade. Nice good job. I'm gonna go on their Widow. I'm on their Widow. I uh, got a Shatter out, he met. Oh, you went fucking tracer? Let's mm sleep. -hmm. What is it? Why is it? Wait, do I have a lever? What the fuck happened? Hi. Oh, wait, is this the thing that hides? Man, that's so stupid. Oh, that's so stupid. Who thought that was a good change? Actually, who? Suppress this target. I need help. <laughs> It doesn't tell me who they swap to. You have to wait like 15 seconds to find out. It's so dumb. You'll miss the front Mr. Table. Mojo Rising just subscribed. Shit. Oh, the Ana on the right is kind of fucking weird. I think John's no, I didn't finish it. No one can die. What is one? Just kidding. Just like crazy. Let's sleep. On his right spawn. Where the fuck is she? Where is she? There's no way she's in that corner. Did they just see nine. Yeah, bro, drop the forty bomb. Record our Ryan like. What? Once he said something. Ooh, the wall climb, the wall climb, the instant wall climb. 